Movie Recap, Robocop, 1987 Directed by Paul Verhoeven, Robocop is a science fiction action film set in a dystopian future Detroit overwhelmed by crime and corruption. The movie follows the transformation of Alex Murphy, Peter Weller, a dedicated police officer, into the titular character Robocop after a brutal attack by a gang of criminals led by Clarence Boddicker, Cutwood Smith. Alex Murphy's transformation into Robocop is orchestrated by the powerful Omni Consumer Products, OCP, corporation, which sees an opportunity to use advanced cybernetics to create a superhuman law enforcement officer. With his human memory suppressed, Murphy becomes Robocop, a cybernetic enforcer with remarkable strength, speed, and weaponry. Robocop's presence on the streets initially appears to be a success, as he begins to dismantle criminal operations and reduce crime rates. However, as he starts to recover fragments of his past memories, he realizes the truth behind his own murder and the systemic corruption that runs deep within the Detroit Police Force and OCP. Throughout the film, Robocop's journey is intertwined with Officer and Lewis, Nancy Allen, his former partner who recognizes his underlying humanity. Together, they uncover a sinister conspiracy involving OCP's plans to demolish and redevelop crime-ridden Detroit into a profitable city of the future, disregarding the well-being of its citizens. The narrative builds to a climactic confrontation between Robocop and Clarence Boddicker, the sadistic criminal responsible for Murphy's death. Robocop's pursuit of justice leads him to unveil OCP's dark agenda to the public exposing the corrupt executives who have been manipulating the city's downfall for their own gain. In the movie's resolution, Robocop confronts OCP's top executive, Dick Jones, Ronnie Cox, and defeats him, finally freeing himself from the corporation's control. As he regains his human memories and emotions, Robocop reclaims his identity as Alex Murphy, highlighting the resilience of humanity even in the face of overwhelming technological transformation. Robocop is a multi-layered film that combines explosive action with social commentary. It critiques corporate greed, unchecked crime, and the ethical implications of blending humanity with machinery. By exploring themes of identity, corruption, and the impact of advanced technology, the movie offers audiences a thought-provoking and adrenaline-pumping cinematic experience. Final Showdown The movie's climax takes place at the abandoned steel mill, where the main antagonist, Clarence Boddicker, played by Cutwood Smith, and his gang have taken Robocop's partner, Officer and Lewis, played by Nancy Allen, hostage. Robocop arrives to confront Boddicker and his gang members, leading to a fierce firefight. Defeat of Boddicker During the battle, Robocop manages to incapacitate most of Boddicker's gang members and eventually confronts Boddicker himself. After a brutal fight, Robocop apprehends Boddicker and holds him at gunpoint. Boddicker reveals that he works for a powerful corporation, Omni Consumer Products, OCP, which has been involved in illegal activities. OCP's Involvement Robocop learns that OCP's senior vice president, Dick Jones, played by Ronnie Cox, is behind much of the crime and corruption in the city, including the creation of Robocop himself. Jones arrives at the scene and tries to use his position to prevent Robocop from arresting him. Showdown with Dick Jones In a tense standoff, Jones takes and Lewis hostage and demands that Robocop lower his weapon. However, Robocop outsmarts Jones by using a hidden data spike to interface with his system, revealing Jones's criminal activities. Robocop then arrests Jones, who is taken into custody by the police. Resolution with Boddicker and Jones captured, Robocop returns to OCP headquarters to confront the company's CEO, known as the Old Man, played by Dan O'Herlihy. Robocop presents evidence of the corruption within OCP and its involvement in criminal activities. The Old Man is shocked and acknowledges the truth. Reclaiming his identity In the film's closing scenes, Robocop finally confronts his past and regains some of his lost memories. He visits his old house, which triggers a flood of emotions and memories of his previous life as Alex Murphy. Despite the loss of his family, Robocop now has a chance to piece together his shattered identity. The movie ends with Robocop, having defeated the corrupt forces that plagued Detroit, walking away determinately to continue his mission of upholding justice in the city.
Robocop explores themes of identity, morality, corporate greed, and the implications of technology in law enforcement, making it a classic in the science fiction genre. Top 20 Reasons to See Robocop 1987 Robocop 1987 offers a unique blend of action, satire, and social commentary that has made it a cult classic. Here are 20 compelling reasons why you should consider watching the film. Iconic sci-fi concept, Robocop presents a futuristic vision of law enforcement through the lens of advanced robotics and cybernetics, offering a captivating and original premise. Action-packed scenes, the film features intense and well-choreographed action sequences that keep you engaged from start to finish. Satirical social commentary, the movie cleverly satirizes corporate greed, media sensationalism, and the dehumanization of technology, offering thought-provoking insights into these societal issues. Memorable characters, characters like Robocop, Clarence Boddicker, and Dick Jones are unforgettable, each with their own motives and arcs. Culturally impactful, Robocop has left a lasting imprint on pop culture with references and parodies in various media over the years. 80s Nostalgia The film captures the essence of the 1980s with its fashion, technology, and overall aesthetic, making it a nostalgic experience for viewers. Peter Weller's Performance Peter Weller's portrayal of Robocop brings depth and humanity to a character who's part man and part machine. Sharp Dialogue the movie is filled with memorable one-liners and impactful dialogues that have become part of cinematic history. Paul Verhoeven's Direction Director Paul Verhoeven infuses the film with his signature style, combining action with social commentary in a way that's both entertaining and thought-provoking. Practical Effects The film's practical effects and prosthetics contribute to the visceral and realistic portrayal of violence and technology. Character Development The transformation of Alex Murphy into Robocop both physically and emotionally, adds depth to the story and engages the audience. Soundtrack, the film's score by Basil Poliduris complements the action and drama, enhancing the overall cinematic experience. Gritty Atmosphere, the dystopian setting of crime-ridden Detroit creates a gritty and immersive world that adds to the film's atmosphere. Morality and Identity Themes, the movie raises questions about the nature of identity, morality, and what it means to be human. Exploration of power dynamics, the struggle between law enforcement, corporate interests, and criminal organizations highlights the complex power dynamics at play in society. Clever product placement parodies, the film subtly satirizes commercialism and consumer culture through its fictional advertisements and news segments. Strong supporting cast, the ensemble cast delivers compelling performances that contribute to the film's overall quality. Classic Robocop design, the iconic Robocop design, with its sleek yet imposing appearance, has become an enduring symbol of the film. Narrative Depth Beneath the action-packed surface, the film delves into deeper themes that invite viewers to reflect on contemporary issues. Cinematic Influence Robocop has influenced subsequent science fiction and action films, making it a crucial piece of cinematic history. Overall, Robocop is a film that offers a blend of action, social commentary, and memorable characters, making it a must-watch for fans of science fiction, action, and thought-provoking storytelling.